Now, uh, basically, if, if you read the Hippolyte mm -hmm. book, you see the claims they make. They say, firstly, uh -huh. that they made continuous observation throughout the year. That's what they do. And secondly, what they've said is they've used the times they've observed for their timetable. And where they have, where it's not possible to see, they've used Akram Ulayyam. Yeah. 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 Akram Ulayyam, we know what Akram Ulayyam is. I don't need to explain that. Now, the issue is what we've done is we've got a copy of their original observations. So when they were going out to observe the notes they were making and what they gave the scholars, we have a copy of that. And you'll see that, inshallah, in, in, a, in a second when you've got the here, here, this is their original observations. So we have that. Now the question is, what they've observed, they've observed two things. They've observed the, the first light, the first light that spreads horizontally, this is subasadik. If it's vertically, then it obviously it's gathered. If, if so they observe that, and then you observe when that light spread. So now, the, the issue come. You know, um, okay, for the sake of Sheikh Khalifa, yeah, what they have done is, the scholars of Blackburn, only five people. They went out in 1988 and then 87 and 88, right? For Subasadi, only they managed 27 successful observations throughout the whole year. Only 27. In the month of January, no observations because of rain. Subasadi. In the month of July, no observations because of rain. In the month of April, only one observation. Uh, in the month of August, only two observations. Only May, they had seven observations. And dated observations with dates, they've only got 11. But the rest is 27 in total for the whole year. Right? Now, one of the major flaw, major error about the Hezbollah Lama timetable is that Hezbollah Lama timetables are different to their own original observed time. And we've got evidence black and white. Right? There's it here now. This is the original, what you call it, timetable, which Sheikh Abdul Qayyim has never seen. All those people who were present last year for the meeting also, they've never seen this year. They've never seen this year. Right? So this is the original, what you call it, timetable, which they have got a signature at the bottom. It's got a signature at the bottom there. This is their Hezbollah Lama timetable. Now, if you look at this, and if you study this very carefully, you will see for yourself, we've put, we've put A here, Right? And the May 21st there, and we put number 1 there and number 2 there. Number 1 stands for first light, where the first light column. It's honestly, it's disrespect to the word of Ishtihad. This, this is disrespect to the word Ishtihad. This is not Ishtihad. Right? And then he claims that he is what you call it, he's uh, observers were all experienced. I personally met a scholar from Blackburn, Morana Hanif Dudwa, he is part of this Umma, well, uh, Umma Welfare Trust and the... Uh, the yeah. Uh, he, he himself met one of the observers at Mufti Shabbir's place in Blackburn. Mufti Shabbir asked Sheikh Ahmad Sidat, who was part of this observation group here, that what did you see, can you tell us about the 1987 observations? He himself said, said, told Mufti Shabbir, or respect to Mufti Sam, I was only there for two to three observations, I didn't know much about it. And uh, I was there. At a, I was at a at a at a dawah there. Uh, in with, uh, we we had we were invited for food. And after food, Sheikh Mister he took me. He stopped the car in Blackburn near where the Azda is, and he told us get out of the car. Then he said, look, here Super Saturday taking place. <laughs> and he called them very 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 experienced. Another observer, same story. Second observer, the same story. So his observers are not experienced. And this report also, you can see his original report also. When you write a report, this is a report of only one person. When five people are observing, I see Subhasarik 151. He, uh, he sees it at 153. He sees his report is 154. But look at this report, only one person's report. What about the location? Yeah, he's making people see. He's making people see. Oh look, Subhasadi, you're writing it down. What about the location, brother? Location was Blackburn and in the, where, where light pollution is. We can, we, we can flip through that also. Okay, successful observations were only carried for 27 days. From Observers did not have the experience of observing. That's, we got evidence for that email, or what, uh, evidence for that also. And the location observers were subject to light pollution. This is the email which I had, which we got from the uh, Mona Ahmed Sidat and Kari Ghulam who were present for those observations. People like Sheikh Abdul Qayyum, they don't even know the names of other observers also. So what did they want to do? What did, what did they read in Miftah's book? Nothing. 
This is the light pollution map, and you can see where the red dot is. This is where black one is. And this is a light pollution map. For this is light pollution, and they're looking towards there. What can they see? You cannot see clearly in light pollution, but they were looking at it. So another mistake. So if you're going to see through light pollution, where there's a lot of light, you're going to see supersonic a little bit later. You can't see it on exactly the same time there. His timetable was sent to Pakistan in 1990, and Mufti Muhammad Ashraf, he what he called, wrote a fatwa saying this timetable of yours, Miftahi, it came about due to lack of knowledge and experience in the matter of in, in the matter of Subasadi. Yeah. yeah, these are what came about due to lack of knowledge with regards to the nature of Subasadi. This fatwa was signed in 1990 by Mufti Usmani also. So it's been rejected from that time. So how can you call this Ishtihad when he has changed his own times? He's, now he's... he's, he's a problem because Imam, Imam Shafi changed all his mazhab. Based yeah. on Dalil. Based, based on, on Dalil. Dalil. There's no Dalil here. There's no, Dalil here. There's no second observations here. There's no second observations here. Yeah. Uh, I, I'm not here to support him or to uh, the most important thing for me because as I told you... Uh, yeah, Sheikh Haysan mentioned the other time also, there's a Shari line. 18 degrees when Subhasadik occurs, that's a Shari line, you cannot cross it. If, you have, that is a Shari ruling, Quranic verse, you cannot move from the Shari line. If 18 degrees, if at 18 degrees Subhasadik is occurring, even if it's 1 o'clock, you have to do 1 o'clock. Because of hardship, uh, late, like you know, this took that time to look half past two, three o'clock, this looks nice. Mm -hmm. We can do Qiyamun late, we can have more, some Musa Kebab and all that. No, you can't do that. This is Nasir Qatari. Yeah. This is like Jews. Jews, they did the same thing. They changed their religion, they changed their laws. It's the same thing. Exactly the same thing. Kitman, they just look Kitman of ilm, like you know, they do because of money, with money. Sheikh Khalifa, they were invited here. It's not that no one invited them here. So when you had your last meeting, we were not invited. But here, they are invited for our meeting, they are invited also to come here. They feel, they're free, free to come and talk and what you call it, defend their timetable. This is the third meeting we're having now, third meeting. But for you, when you made the decision, we were not invited. But this is a more fairer meeting because we are inviting them also and we we, we, we here also to what you call it criticize the timetable in front of them. Can we just summarize please? Yes. Like we need to be just every every I don't want to be by saying I'll start from uh Muslim sides over there. If you just go around you go around starting from Muslim side you know you're there you do the presentation. If you just uh, give us a summary, inshallah, from what Brother Rashidi talked about at the beginning, in terms of uh, the criteria that you believe, I mean, the options are, you know, really the two options are the 18 degrees and the Hizbul Ulema time. Yeah, the 18 degrees what, is... Which, which one you're going to be going with, and also in terms of if you would like uh, a, a declaration made with all the people that are here, and you would like your name on the declaration, yeah. to turn around and say, this is what we decided on this day, um, what we'll be doing for Ramadan. And finally, in terms of any, uh, just give us any sort of like uh, uh, plans that you think that we should do in the future in terms of consolidating, how, you know, for example, in terms of if you're going to be telling the, the people in your masjid, uh, if you're going to be doing some programs or anything like that, you think it should be done in order to raise the awareness. But there are three things I want to know in terms of action plan, uh, what you're going to be adopting, and, and also uh, in terms of the declaration. So Inshallah, like, I'm, I'm not fully willing to put my name for the declaration. I promote 18 degrees also. I've got evidence for 18 degrees. I've got evidence why to show to show what you call why is going to my time table is wrong also and inshallah we'll be what you call holding workshops in uh, in and around our east london masajids and we'll be writing uh, pamphlets and leaflets also distributed to the public and make, making the public aware also that this time table is wrong here that is going to my time table yep and what just just sheikh khalifa one more sad thing also after miftahi being get, being caught now not using his time now now he tells the people, like, you know, there is flexibility in the time of Suhoor because Hazrat Abu Bakr used to eat just before till sunrise. Now, when we check the sources also of Hazrat Abu Bakr eating before sunrise, it's all mansukh. Because of the verse of the Quran, Sahih Hadith. So he's using, he's using mansukh hadith to support now. He's got no other alternative left now, so he's, support, he's using mansukh hadith. Hazrat Abu Bakr used to eat till before sunrise now. There's flexibility in the time of Suhoor now. No, not <laughs> Abrogated.
He's using abrogated hadith now. To, he's got nothing to hold on to now. He's now he's holding on to abrogated hadith now. Oh, he's used it before sunrise. La hawla wa la quwwata illa billah. What kind of ishtihad is this? I want to say first and foremost, Jazakallah uh, Khairan for Islamic Cultural Center and uh, Dr. Khalifa for at least allowing us to come here because this is willingness to show that they're at least listening to the other side of the argument and I think that it reads uh, great appreciation. Uh, even uh, we can criticize as much as we want and we can look at all of the downfall but we have to look also at the good side that just to come here and to at least give our opinion that is a very good sign. There is willingness, uh, inshallah, in the future. But even though we are looking at this side of it, that even uh, I mean, there is opportunity that we can have a bigger conference. So we don't want to close the doors. We want to keep it open, and we have keep on having the dialogue. So jazakallah khairan to Dr. Khalifa. Uh, I mean, the conclusion of uh, Balam Mosque in Islamic Center is that we will be adopting 18 degrees for Soba Sali. And uh, I just want to end by saying that. The knowledge of Regent's Park Islamic Cultural Centre having a very important role in the whole of London. Whatever decision is happening here, it does have an impact, impact on the people because I am there and dealing with the issues in Ramadan here in Tuting and people will come and they say Regent's Park, they bring the timetable and say this is Regent's Park timetable. People come, they say Islam Channel, this is their timetable and they are following, uh, now invalidating the path of the people, we are following majority of the mosques. This was the reply we get. So it's like creating, we are creating the fitna. The issue of the moon sighting, we made it clear we had open debates on the Islam channel and we explained there is no fatwa you cannot find that you have to follow Saudi Arabia and take it as your focal point. There is no fatwa to say that. La We have made it and made our own issue. Anyway, that's a separate discussion which you can have, but we, we do not follow even with Saudi so the sighting, the Eid, the declaration, we don't follow reasons for. So there is already disunity. This unity is already there. It's not like we came here and everybody was united. So nobody is creating this unity. So what has happened, we are looking that there is an attempt to try and unite the people on a criteria which is obviously based on evidence. Uh, and, and that needs to be addressed. So 18 degrees, now that we've seen, we've, there is a doubt in the other timetable that Regent Park have adopted last year before Ramadan. Leave alone wrong, even if there is doubt in it. So simply let's take that uh, ruling and leave that which is doubtful to where there is no doubt in it. So we don't want to take the burden of the path of the people on our shoulders. Because we are taking that responsibility and we will say it's it the hard that those people they will follow it, they will accept it. So the path of the people, they will say we are following whatever has been declared. But who is making decisions? Like when a decision was made last time, whoever is sitting around here and they came to that correct meaning they are taking that responsibility. So similarly uh, those who are deciding now, and we are quite confident that as was practiced before 18 degrees, that is the right uh, decision to follow, uh, to adopt during the 10 months of the year, excluding those two months, which we, inshallah, we will hope to meet after Ramadan. That is the 21st of May, 23rd of May to 21st of July. That needs to be addressed after the month of Ramadan, because this year we fall into normal 18 degrees, which coincides with Mushahada. So that is all I want to say is, we will, inshallah, take this information back and explain to the people that we will be adopting the 18 degrees. This, this, you can't make it. So this, this issue has no clear text. But yeah, there is text Quran. in the Quran. Just wait, please. Mm -hmm. No clear text from the Quran or the Sunnah, which means that it's open for many interpretations. Yeah, so the Sadiq is Qata'i, the established. There's no difference of opinion. Our issue is 18 degrees and Hizb al-Ulama. Hizb al-Ulama is not based on Subha Sadiq time. No, they, yeah. that is the issue. This is not super sadiq. So the kulu wa shara wa hata it means it has to be established, qat'iyun, and has to be concrete. His his well, he, time he, table is not even observed times. So you need to get that into your head now. It's, it's, it's not even observed times. They've changed it. So this is not ishtiyad anymore now. It, it, it's, saying that they, it, it's saying the bayun was at this time, but we're going to tell them to keep eating. Look, I'm not, I, again, to confirm, I'm not supporting him. This is the main thing. The main thing is to, to come together. It doesn't yeah. matter. I don't know. No. And the we can't use all of this. Just to say, this. We need to follow one. Uh, that's why I, I think Dr. Dubai is waiting mm -hmm. for a big conference too. Because we based in, in the last 15 or 20 years, we followed uh, the, the same day based on a fatwa from the Rabbit al Alam Islam. Mm. So anybody come and say, well, on which basis you follow the, this is our, uh, but when the, 
the most, you say your part mosque is very strict and is very is doing this and the, this unity um, this unified ummah and you need to come we said to, to them we discussed this for about more than one year they think brother Zahir attended some and he missed but in the end and even though Sheikh Mufti came here he discussed many the major mosques in London the directors of the major mosques they came and we discussed this and as I said, we we don't support any any uh, any. We just we need to come together. We need to be. Uh, we need to follow the the the, the, the great scholar and to be open to be like as you mentioned. This is uh, the uh, many people follow here, and we have we can't misguide people anymore. Yeah. So the major thing is to unify Muslims. This is a, what, not about Muftah or anybody else. One question. One question. Do you unify them all around? <coughs> Yeah, that okay, we, we are discussing you now to come to the, the right. Yeah, so we all cheating, but the same in yeah, Sharifa. Yeah. 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 Before, they were following this, but the thing now, they should follow this. And we brought the idea. Degree. Would you accept it? I think what's important here is the delay, is the delay. No, I, I, if, if I someone agree, can explain I to agree. me, someone can explain to me why when when someone observes, and this is the whole thing. When we talk about the the usul of ishtiyah, we can discuss that all day long. The question here is that when I, if I tell you that I observe at this time, and and, and actually um, I've seen it half an hour earlier, or I'm telling you to eat for twenty minutes longer. Now I want to know why. We are not talking about Hizb al yeah. Let's say, for example, the Rabita of, uh, the, uh, and the Mashayif decide that it is not 18 degrees. I'm not saying Hizb al I'm not saying 12, I'm not saying 15. I'm only trying to see, are you as open to the debate as we are, or you have a final thing and we are the ones who have to make the decision? Because <laughs> we are called <laughs> no, 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 the and ulama, majority ulama, all the world. Decided to evidence. Yeah. What okay. I am saying okay. to you is, would you accept it or not? If the facts were presented fairly and they heard both situations, we have said, as we fought for ulama on a number of occasions, and we have asked senior ulama to come and address us, we've said, if you sit there and you're the Qadi and we've agreed who the scholars are, then we are happy to agree with that. As long as every party is given the opportunity to present their facts. Because, because that would be fair. Looking and we've we'll probably have said that on a number of occasions. We've said, we, 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 let's have scholars that we agree on, let's have them there, let's present our facts, and let them make a decision. We're, you know, we're up for that. Or well, I'm up for that. I, I can't speak for that. This is the first time we're talking about. In 1983, with the Ulema of the Jamiyat, in the Black Fruit, there was a three-day meeting. The Ulema. This meeting, करने वाले ये जमीयत उलमा खुद हैं। उन्होंने इसमें 18 डिग्री बस सब ने यूनाइटेड किया दस्तखत किया था, है ना? उन्होंने ही किया था, फिर उसके बाद उन्होंने चेंज कर दिया। इज़्मा के खिलाफ
So we should be sticking to 18 degrees, and inshallah, Allah will put barakah and Allah will bring us, uh, he will unite us on the haq. Yes, we have this arm as a layman. I want to ask to the Imam Sahib. We went to his home after all those meetings. Three of us. With Thai Sahib. He now, today as well, that he is confusing the whole Ummah and he is not coming out to answer. We spent up to 1 a.m. sitting with him. He did not give a one answer to the request. And I don't think he is the right person. May Allah forgive him. What he is doing, maybe he don't know. I will never follow the time. Last year we followed because of this person. We have respect. We keep on coming since many years for the sake of unity. That's why we are sitting here. We want to give people a benefit as well so they can easily do that. But there is no when the hard is finished, how can we give the benefit afterwards? You know, with all the respect, I personally don't trust that man. We've been trying to contact him, we've been to him. He's not there to answer, like in here, example is there. So I don't trust him. And I have read his book as well. It's on my with me as well. So we will follow, inshallah, whatever we are. We, we are going to reality truth. In front of 3,000 people, their fast is of the state. Mm. And we are responsible if we know the truth and still follow that. So who is responsible to Allah? Yes. Also in Lester, the body or Lasco. Uh, majority. Yeah. <coughs> I think that uh, the last meeting, Sheikh Haitham said something which is very important. And that was uh, this 18 degree time period in the year 300 after Hijrah. Is going back to that time, was the Ulama of that time had done an Ijma on that time. And this 18 degrees has gone on until today, this is 1421. If you look at India, Pakistan, and all these countries, 1100 <coughs> we've had Ulama sticking to that 18 degrees. One Bodhisattva, one Adim Sahib to come today, 15 years ago, and say that this is the time. And then after after those times have been scrutinized, for them to come out wrong, I don't see any reason whatsoever or any shady principle that we should abandon the time that has, that has been going on for the past 1100 years of psychology research. That's one thing. The other thing is, with Maulana Yaqub Muftahi, he's not here, unfortunately, but it's not the case where he's not being questioned at all. I don't that through because he answers to some people. Sheikh Farid from the Maulana Farid Sahib, he had an email conversation with him. So many of those questions that, uh, that were there, we put over to him, and those questions have remained unanswered. And that's what anyone, I think, on the Rifaqul Ulama website, these email, that email trail is there for everyone to see. And basically on that, I think we have no option other than to follow the team. Uh, uh, as I mentioned earlier, it's the most important thing for the some countries in the EU is to to uh, unify the, the, the Muslims. Right? It doesn't matter who, uh, who, who the, the, the person or the, the one who who has a recognized the timetable. The most important thing is also for the most is to to follow the what I recognize a well-known scholar or senior scholar to mention in this regard. Uh, this is this is the, 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 so we are willing to change if this will, uh, will unify Ummah and also if it is based on uh, uh, what a, a senior and well-known scholar. Well, uh, thank you very much.
Yeah, even when we when we follow 18 degrees before, as you mentioned earlier, yeah. or for more than 15 years, yeah. people yeah. also still accusing yeah. of causing the thing. Yeah. So yeah. 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 this is yeah. 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 a yeah. 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 If it was fitna, you would have changed from 15 to 18 degrees. Hmm. You, you, we convinced you, we convinced them that it was wrong. I said, yes, we are wrong. Now we are on the track. And now from track, you go back again to that. Yeah, yeah. inshallah. One more thing also, the year of Beast, which took place last year, has not unified anything. It's not unified anything. It's not unified. It's not unified. It's not unified. If you print a new one against that, that will not be unified. There's no unity now. موسيقى
for me to sit here and assume that you know it's all hunky dory, everything fine, and Prophet Guru will be happy, so I'm happy. And for you to say that you had major masjid here represented is totally wrong. Sure. You had Al Mumtaz Al Islami, Rafat Al Islami. You have right every masjid agreed is a big mosque, and so is Regis Park itself. This is the main. We've got here Harrow, Hounslow, up uh, Abu Bakr Masjid in South. This is a major mosque. You got You got Croydon Mosque, your major center. We Fakul Roma again represents several other masjids, and you also got representations from even up north, right? Where they, you know, this is actually the truth. And it's the heart. This is not a matter of ishtihad as far as I'm concerned. And I put it to you again, you know, you say you use the hadith of the pious brother having a saying the shahada and you, you accept that moon sighting from him. And yet when a brother is sitting right next to you, he's a pious person, he's a Muslim, and he's telling you I have observed the sun, the the, 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 the sunrise and I've observed the Subha Sadi time. And then you shut your ears to it, I think that's absolutely wrong. And I'm also very disappointed I had a great deal of regard regard for the Kudubian, and I don't use my words. That I'm very disappointed. Last meeting he said he didn't know about the meeting, and this meeting was arranged with his full knowledge, yet he did not see fit to come here because he did not want to change anything. Mm -hmm. And that's a great shame and it's a disservice to the Ummah. Because to us, he's like a leader, and he's the leader of the London Muslims. Because he can control and does control the media. And actually, the media should go to the central mosque, <coughs> and they come to the central mosque. Mm -hmm. Now, Alhamdulillah, you're here, you're hearing us. Whether this has any any bearing on your feelings, but I think even each and every one of us are responsible, and we are answerable to Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala for our actions, and we cannot, I cannot shut my eyes and pretend, you know, that I, nothing's happened. And even at this late stage, rather than divorcing Miftahi, I would like to go and meet him with you guys to his house and say the further. This is matter of deen. We do not have politics here. We just want to to guide our Muslims the best we can. And I plead with you, yourself, as the sheikh of this masjid, to accompany us. To sheikh Miftari. Let's search the truth. Let's, let's, yeah. let's bring him, yeah. either, either get persuaded by him, or persuaded by him. him. Yeah. 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 And, and also, sheikh Atul Qayyum. He is sitting in his office, I've visited his office in the masjid. And he's very insular. And you know, he's, he's a high authority, alhamdulillah. But I'm also disappointed that such a big mosque has got a person like that in place, who is not accountable to them. He did, they probably don't, the committee probably don't even know what the truth is about this. And for them to be, you know, ignorant of and blinded by, it's a great shame. And you know, it's our duty, forget what he's done. It's our duty to go there and knock on the door and brothers and plead. This is something we can do physically and we should do. And it should not be delayed beyond a couple of days. That's our beloved prophet. With him at that time, they were Munafiqin and they were Kafirin. So I don't want to be a Kafir or Munafiq. So I am with the Haq, and the Haq is being, you know, the appeared now to me, and he's in the same degree. So I'm with the Haq. Okay, but just an idea, you know, I don't know if you're going to have chairman of the Greenfield Mosque, and I'm the Joint General Secretary and Communication and Media uh, Officer of the West uh, London Sydney Magic Council. So it's made up a uh, big mosque, like yeah. you were saying, it's part of the Western Yes, yeah. part of the Western Forum as well. And uh, we got like Hansel Mosque, Harrow Mosque, Brentford, Greenford, all the Hayes, you know, about 12 mosques biggest together. And we all decided to have 18 degrees about something. Everyone uh, agreed to it. And like he gave a presentation, this is a third meeting. Okay, how much evidence we have to give, how much a meeting we have to do one after, one after another to, to convince everyone. This is a dividing of a Muslim. You know, in the last Ramadan in Lincolnshire, some people would say, uh, end the fast at 1 o'clock. And the other, other most right ne next door, they end the fast about half past three. So there's big difference in the dividing of So they've never seen this before. For, for myself, I am convinced for 18 degrees. Mm -hmm. However, is the masjid going to follow it or not? <laughs> Allah. Mm -hmm. Brothers, I'm, I'm from Masjid al Bakr in Wolfenstone. Um, I'm the vice chairman of the talk about four months ago. Quite young, man. <laughs> um, we, uh, the masjid have decided unanimously, including the scholars, the imams of the masjid, that we're following 18 degrees. Um, just, I don't want to go too long, but compared to all the other masjids, we've got a, more, a lot more to lose on making this decision, yeah? That's one thing. And I'm taking from over here, I think 99% are going to follow this timetable 
We know the ulama in this country, most of them follow this 18 degree timetable. I think it's time that Regents Park Mosque and other masjid, um, it's a fitrah of a man to be firm but fit. Right? Although there's unity, you only unite on Quran and Sunnah. And what I see here, alhamdulillah, there's a lot of elders, there's not many youngsters, but the majority of youngsters will follow the 18 degree timetable. So as this goes on, yeah, the Regis, Regis Park, um, Islam Mosque, and anyone else who continues to follow this uh, Hizbullah Ulama timetable, or whatever you call it, it's going to cause big, big problems.